So let's go ahead and announce the winner of the last little give back I posted the other day. Go ahead and email me at oldmomnewtricks at gmail.com and give me your address and I'll get your bath bombs out to you. Miss Shivani, you are the winner. Congratulations and thanks all of you guys for commenting. I really appreciate it. Enjoy the demo, you guys. Hey, you guys. Welcome back. Tonight we have a bath bomb from Moon's Harvest and it is so, so pretty. This one is the To Be a Unicorn bath bomb and it is really, really big. Not exactly sure how much it weighs. I'm sorry. Um, I'll have it listed in the description below. But this one is scented in berries, pink mimosas, sweet honeydew, and tangerine crystals. And I think it smells, it definitely smells like those those fruits i smell them all and it smells very candied it smells kind of like 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 a lollipop so um i can't wait to take this bath i think um i think it's going to be really pretty right now moon's harvest is actually closed they won't be up until the middle of august their site is down because they moved to a bigger and better shop down the road and that'll be really exciting for all of us so this actually isn't going to be available right right now i'm not sure if these are going to be restocked i hope they will be because i know a lot of people would like these and haven't been able to get their hands on them yet but let's go ahead and put this little beauty in the water and see what she can do because i'm really really needing this bath right now Oh, I already smell that. It smells so, so good. It's already coming up. And I didn't mention, but um, that is bubble bar icing on top. The white. Which is usually how these specialty bombs come of theirs. They have some kind of bubble bar on them in them, on top of them, <laughs> decorated with the bubble bar icing somehow. I'm very interested to see what color this water ends up to be. Could be pinkish, purple. I don't think it's going to end up being any kind of blue or green, but we just don't know. I have to see. Well, that's a cool little pattern. Couldn't be any more upside down or and or backwards. <laughs> they go how they want to go though. I'm 
So this synth is really, really pretty. It's, it's soft, it's kind of, I get the, the melon and the pink mimosa and the berry, and um, it's a very, just soft and sugary. It's just a really nice light scent. It's very pleasant. Okay, so that was our last little piece of waffle and then our bubble frosting just vanished at the same time. Check out this water. It looks like it's just a super, super light, like a lavender, just barely. So, oh my gosh, it's super soft, really soft. This is gonna be nice. Okay. I'm not surprised, I figured with all that bubble icing that we would get a nice tub full of bubbles. I'm sorry I'm not talking so much right now, you guys. I pulled a muscle in my shoulder and it hurts so bad. There's really not a lot you can do for that. You just kind of have to wait it out. I do not have the best back, shoulders, things like that. So hanging over the tub, shooting a biathlon video is probably not the best thing for it, but I think this bath is gonna be, be nice and make it a little bit better. Okay, so I had to show this to you guys. This is one of the fullest that my tub has been with bubbles. So once or twice has it been this full, or maybe have I let it get this full, let's say. But um, I guess I'll just let you guys know how my to be a unicorn bath was when I'm done. So I'll see you in a few minutes. So these kind of bubbles are, they're really great. They're my favorite ones. They're the kind of, they're the ones you can play with because they stick together. They stick together really well. Sorry, you didn't know you were taking another bubble bath with me again tonight. <laughs> but yeah, this is a lot of fun. I like these a lot. Okay, so I am done with my to be a unicorn bath and it was magical. No, it was wonderful. I really, really loved it. There's really nothing to clean up in this tub. The moisture level, I think, was the star of this show. It was really, really nice and moisturizing. My skin feels amazing. I don't really need any lotion or body butter, but of course I'm gonna put it on because I have some and I love that kind of stuff. But you don't really need any after this bath because it was just really, really nice and soft. Um, so the water cover color was just, you know, it was a light purple and that's fine too. Um, of course, the bubbles were just absolutely amazing. So this bath bomb was definitely a hit. And I just can't wait until Moon's Harvest opens back up because I know everybody wants to repurchase their favorite bombs or try some new ones that they haven't had before. So I will have all of their links listed down below as always. And I guess I will just see you back here for the next demo. So thank you guys for watching as always. And I'll just see you back here next time. Bye-bye.